to the first video in a series of three videos that show you how to edit projects in BRMS and have your changes pushed out to OpenShift. This first video is about cloning a BRMS project from GitHub and adding a hook in BRMS so whenever there's a change in your BRMS projects the change gets pushed out to GitHub. So let's do it. Here this is my BRMS installation. It's BRMS Workbench running locally in my machine. So I'm going to clone my repo. Clone repo. Repo name will be Decision Services. Organization unit. My GitHub URL is this. Whoops. Correct. Get the correct URL. Here it is. And now I'm going to clone it. Cloned. Awesome. So as you can see, we already have some, some changes here. And I'm gonna to go to project authoring and I'll edit this file. So the objective is whenever there's a change in this project to push these changes out to GitHub. This is very easy. We just need to add a few files, okay? So first of all, we need to set the URL, the remote URL for this project. So let's uh, go to the project. Uh, this is the GitHub git uh, files, VRMS git files in my machine. So I'll edit the remote URL. GitHub.com, repository, decision server. This is a slightly different uh, GitHub URL since it uses SSH. Uh, so you have to have your keys pre-configured in order to use SSH. Great. Next step is to add the hook file. So I'm going to copy a hook file that I have here already. Copy the file. It's a very simple file. I can show you there's nothing special in there. Just a push, right? To change the permissions in this file. So BRMS can do anything he wants with it. Okay, and now we already have the hooks configured. So that means that if I make a change here to BRMS, the change will be, will be sent out to GitHub. So say, hey you, get out of my way. Let's save it. Well, before, let's just come to the BRMS and show you that uh, it's not there. So the last change was changed to my man 13 minutes ago. Now let's do a change to hey you, save, change it to hey you. I'm going to save, BRMS is saving, and now it says that it has been saved. So if we come here to GitHub, you see that it has changed it to Heyu. So this was the first video. Please follow along the next ones. Thank you.